What is going on guys? My name's Rano and welcome to new Pokemon Snap. This game literally just came out and I already got my hands on it and I have been waiting to be able to play this for you guys for so long now. The time is finally here. I know it's been a while since I've uploaded a video on the channel and I wanted to talk about that a little bit maybe in a separate video but basically to sum it up I just haven't had a lot of time to do things I've had a lot going on right now um you guys know how it is um yeah hopefully I want to be coming back more though I have a lot of content that I've been trying to work on um so hopefully you guys will be seeing some of that soon um with that said though let me oh wait there's like a cursor okay I guess we'll go to English voices no voice English or Japanese? Okay, okay. I'm gonna go English voices because I'm an English speaker myself. Um, and you can change character voices later so I can see like if one of the other options is better. But what I was going about uh, earlier, I want to have more content for you guys. And I'm going to try to be more active on here and on Twitch. I've kind of been taking a break from things. Twitch might be changing though. I don't know how that's gonna go. Um,. Anyway, I'll try to keep you guys more in the loop, more updated on what's going on, not trying to take more like month-long, sudden month-long breaks and then just come back, oh hey guys, like nothing happened. Um, but yeah, so let's uh, into the game here, I guess. Oh wait, I guess I pick how I look. Um, I'm going to say I'm, uh, I can't change my appearance later, okay. I'm going to go with this guy. Oh no, that's me. Are you ready to start? Put me in. Oh, look at this. This looks so good. Laboratory of Ecology and Natural Sciences. Wait, let me turn this up. Is that voice acting? New Pokemon Snap. It's time. Oh, this game looks beautiful. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Cutscene. Oh, well, never mind then. <laughs> it's okay, the voice acting now. Uh, hi there. I'm glad you made it. Welcome to the Laboratory of Ecology and Natural Sciences. Or Lens for... Okay. <laughs> or Lens for short. My name is Mirror. Um, I'm researching Pokemon and their natural environment here on Florio Island. Yeah, so... Yeah, and that's not all. The professors are gonna... Uh, study every single island here in the Lento region. No one's ever done an ecological survey like this before. It's gonna be amazing. Huh? No one. Aren't you forgetting a certain explorer? Huh? Oops, good point. You've read the stories of Captain Vince, haven't you? But. Are you even counting him? Professor, uh, your survey is gonna be the first of its kind in a hundred years. That's awesome. Thank you. Well, thanks. Uh, this is Rita. Her parents are good friends of mine. She's here on vacation while her school's on break. Jeez. I'm not just here to goof off, Professor. I'm your research assistant. <laughs> ah, yes, that's right. And I appreciate the help. Anyway. Now, before we go over what you'll be doing in this program, uh, why don't we step into the lab to get settled? Yep. Right you are, Professor. I'll lead the way. I wish I had, like, full voice acting for this. No. Alright. Allow me to explain. And they got an Odno in the back? The Lento region is absolutely teeming with Pokemon. Photographing those Pokemon helps us learn more about them and their ecosystem. Mm. Hey guys, did they? That's exactly what you're here to do. By the way. By the way? At night. Uh, you might even get to see glowing Pokemon. They're really pretty. Alright. Now without further ado, here is your research camera. 
I've got the same one. We can use them to communicate with each other and the rest of the team, too. That's right. It's more than just a camera. It lets you keep in touch and analyze data on the fly. Yep. It'll also serve as a sort of... Where is he going? As a sort of ID badge for you here. So take good care of it. Awesome, right? <laughs> the professor invented it. Professor. Uh, can I explain how to use the professor? Anyway. Sure thing, Rita. Assist away. I'll go take care of some other preparations. Yeah. All right, come on, let's go outside. I wish what else Pokemon they got in the lab. The throws are based on default button layouts. So can I change it later on? <laughs> Perfect timing. Hey, Vivalon. Try getting a shot of that Pokemon. You can press the A button to take a photo. Oh, they got actual voice acting here. How do I move? Yes, he's going. Now why don't you try moving the camera to line up your shot? See that circle in the center of your viewfinder? That's called the pointer. If you use the left stick to move the pointer around, the camera will move to follow it. Give it a try. Okay, there we go. There we go. Okay. Hold on now. You can point the camera up and down, and even spin all the way around, left or right. I don't like how she's looking at me like that. You can use motion controls to aim your camera too. Can I? Oh look! Here comes Pikachu. Oh yeah, turns. Try getting a shot of that Pikachu. First, move the pointer so it's lined up with Pikachu. I can't use motion controls. That's crazy. Did you see that shape appear around Pikachu just now? Whatever that shape is around is the subject of your photo. Remember that. It'll be important when the professor's evaluating your photos. Try snapping a photo. That's it. Great job. I couldn't readjust. But since Pikachu's a little far away, it looks kind of small, huh? Times like this call for zooming in. Here's the right stick. To zoom in, just hold the ZL button. Oh, the ZL you button. Zoomed in until you let go. Try snapping a photo of Pikachu looking nice and big. Uh huh? Great! Yummy! How much bigger look that time? You want your subject's whole body smack dab in the middle of the frame, looking big. Looks like you've already gotten the hang of using your camera. You're doing great! Oh, right! You can adjust your camera and motion controls from the settings menu. Oh. You can also adjust them from the pause menu while you're out doing research. Hey, okay. Professor! You've covered the basics! Is he coming back? Oh, there he is. Hello. How is that? I hope you're getting the hang of uh, your research camera. Anyway. Now then, I'll evaluate the photos you took. First of all, would you mind choosing one shot of each Pokemon you photographed? I'll rate them using my special scoring system. Pick whichever shots you think are the best. All right. Well, I got one shot of Vivalon and two shots of Pikachu. Uh, okay. Hold on. Let me. I pick this one. Looking nice and big. And it's the only shot I got in the vivid one. Uh, right. Oh, uh, what? <laughs> Shadow photo number one. I'm talking about the Pikachu. New. Oh, it's Pikachu. The first time you've gotten it as your subject. Um. What? One of four. Wait, one to four stars. Came with his and with understanding and categorize how Pokemon behave. Photos of Pokemon ordinary shake a few stars, more unusual behavior means more stars. Simple enough, right? To be clear, the number of stars photos received doesn't affect its score. Every category is important. By the way, the camera keeps logs of what was happening when you took the photo. That would be categorize them. Uh, let's move on to the scoring. First off, I the pose. Just the right movement is key to getting a high pose score. That's on the other factor, that's one star. Size, straightforward, and the direction your Pokemon is facing. Next is placement, try to get the Pokemon in the center of the frame. Finally, another Pokemon in the background. Or, it's another Pokemon in the background. I know it's all at once. Let me boil it down. Remember this and you'll be fine. Get the Pokemon nice and big in the center of the frame, and then snap the shutter. With all that in mind, here's your evaluation. I got. Hard to believe you're a beginner. 
That's just what it started though. We got Vivalon. Next is Vivalon, a new addition to our research. Nice work. Uh, season flight. That's going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Hey, that don't mean it's good either. Remember, getting the whole Pokemon frame looking nice and big is the key to a good size score. Maybe if I knew how to zoom in, if Rita would have showed me. What'd you think? Uh, once you get your photos evaluated, you can use them to fill out your very own Pokemon photo decks. That will be a great milestone uh, to work towards. Uh, that about does it. I think it's time you set off on your adventure. Uh, that should about do it. See this pod? It'll carry you on your photography expeditions. Um, it's called the Neo One. <laughs> it's the best. It can teleport to far off places in no time flat. I finally put the finishing touches on it not long ago with the help from someone I know. Uh, you see, it makes use of energy hotspots scattered throughout the lentil region. Jeez. Come on, Professor, the details can wait. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Let's get you moving. Climb on in and touch your camera to the console. Alright. So I guess I'm going now. Huh? My controller. Go going crazy. My controller is going crazy. Uh, research lab. Okay. Where am I at? I guess I probably have to do this one, huh? This is probably the tutorial. So, oh wait, oh yo. That's the entrance to Florio Nature Park. The Neo One will automatically follow a set route. You can just focus on looking around and taking photos. Where Grookey go? Look at all the buffalo. Oh, There's too many Pokemon. I'm trying to, Hey, look at this Vivalon getting real up and close. Beedoof! Well then. What's up above me? Is that another Vivalon? Probably. The Wurmple. What are these? <laughs> what the hell? Oh, hey! What? What's that? I a Moga. It's a Moga. Well, I can't move that fast. Crystal blue. I got one of these Moga ones that comes by. Hey! <laughs> Don't go away. Don't leave. Ah. Oh, there's one right there too. Oh, the beetle dams. It was in them again, like it was in, uh, in Pokey Park. What else can I get here? Hey, oh, there's Grookey again. Okay? He's hiding. Hey, Pichu. I'm trying to get, like, everything I can see. More Bidoof! I really am just in love with this, how this game looks. Like... Oh, wait, that's it. Oh, I missed it. There's a Dodrio with the Bidoof. 
I might turn on motion controls just so it's like faster because there's some shots that I I miss. Oh, Taylor, Taylor, Taylor. Oh, I got it at just the perfect time. Alright, there's some warp on there, more Vivalon. Is it another map, huh? Bing. Oh, that was amazing! Whoa! What are all these? Hello? Comfy. Is that a checkpoint up there? Floor, floor is, floor is. Hey, look at me, look at me. There you go. <laughs> that symbol marks the spot where you'll teleport back to camp. Oh, right, teleport back to camp. So that's like the Basically, end of my route. It's the end of the course. Basically, it's the end of the course. When you get back, I'll take a walk to start. Okay. So now this is where I get evaluated. I really like this game. Welcome back. Uh oh, welcome back. I hope you had a good time in Florio Nature Park. Anyway. Now as I before, it's time to show me some photos you took. Go ahead and choose one photo per Pokemon. Alright, let's go. We got my boy Dodrio. We got Grookey. We got the Buffalon. We got... I'm going to say this one of Pichu is better. This Beedoof one. I should have got one of him building the dam. Actually. Now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> Look at this one. <laughs> um, Shoot. I'm going to say... You know what? I'm going to say... I'm going to say this one. This one for Swana. This one for you. And Wurmple. No subject, I'll oh, just crystal blue. Um one, two I guess I'll put another one in for Vivalon. Um Yeah, I should've got one of beef at the dam. Let's see my evaluation. Alright. So nice look. work. Decent flight. Nice work, give it up. Oh, is this That's a downgrade. That's that is a downgrade. I'll keep I'll keep that one. A new discovery. A new addition to our research. Nice work. It looks like it's fast asleep. Nice going. This isn't a bad shot at all. Oh, that one's that one's gonna be a good score. That's okay. There we go. Silver star. A new discovery. Next we got Grookey. Nice work. Must be in a hurry. <laughs> Oh, first time I got a... Your, your placement is good. Uh, centering your subject bounces the photo as well. Listen, man, I was in a hurry. I was in a hurry. A new Buffalo. Nice work. Seems calm. Alright, let me just kind of like... Go through these. A new discovery. Nice work. A new discovery. A new discovery. Nice work. What is it? I don't know. A new discovery. A new discovery. Nice Placement is good. Centering it balances it. A new discovery. Perfect timing. And then the ecosystem. A new discovery. A new discovery. Nice centering. Okay, yeah. Magic card. Look at this picture, man. <laughs> Look at him. How far back he is there. Placement, I got 1,000? I got a perfect centering on the magic card picture. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. <laughs> this part is gonna take a while. I can feel that. Uh, direction could be better. Watch when it looks right at the camera. It did. None of them ever looked at me. How was it? 
Uh, so what did you think? Anyway. Uh, one last thing. Let me tell you about research levels. Are you... Man... Uh, your research level on a course tells you how much progress you've made there. Um, once that level goes up, you may see Pokemon behave in ways you haven't seen before. The key to raising your research level is to observe all types of Pokemon's behaviors. Mm -hmm. That means getting photographs of them in every category, from one star to four. So, uh, so in short, fill up that photo deck. Keep in mind, and you'll be on the right track. So get out there and snap lots of photos, and cherish the encounters with Pokemon you have along the way. Uh, great work researching this new site. I hope your trip goes just as well, or your next trip goes just as well. I got a gift. Photo program newbie. Smack dab in the middle. Oh, I got because the, the perfect score on Magikarp. <laughs> you know what? Let me save the photos to my album. I'm like. Oh, wait. Hold on. After research trip, you can choose photos to save your album, which is in your space in the lab. You can also choose to resnap. Okay, wait, so, like, can I go back? Let me return to camp. I want to see if I can go back in and save them, because obviously you would have to, like, like, save the pictures, right? Uh, that covered just about everything. Can we go on a nighttime photo shoot later? Not yet, but soon. After a little more practice. Also. Uh, by the way, don't forget you can come back to the lab and take a look at your photo decks anytime. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, I'll explain more about that when you stop by the lab. Well, don't let me keep you any longer. Go have a good time and snap some photos. Um, alright. So. With that. Hey, Vivalon. I am going to uh, get out of here for now. Um, first impressions, I really like this game. This game is beautiful. I love seeing all the Pokemon and being able to see like all of them in their natural habitats. Um, and like how they interact with each other. Like how the Dodrio came and like scared away the Talo. I really like seeing that. And like Grookey and Pichu playing with each other. It's, it's really cool to see. And I really, really am impressed with this game and like just how it looks and everything about it. Like I just, I really like this game. I'm gonna keep playing it on here. Um, that's pretty much all I got to say on that. Um, but no, this this game this game is beautiful. Um, I'm gonna keep playing it. I don't know how long the game is. I don't know how long it takes to like complete the game if you can. Um, but. Having said that, we are going to keep playing this. I'm going to make this like kind of a series on here. Um, and uh, yeah, so with that being said, with that all out of the way, uh, thank you guys for watching this, uh, this first video here of new Pokemon Snap. If you enjoyed... Um, be sure to leave a like down below and in the comments tell me what you think of this game if you have gotten it for yourself or if you've just seen it from from my playthrough or other playthroughs what do you think of new pokemon snaps this is a game you would get let me know or do you already have it also don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and hit the bell to be notified every time i upload a new video and as always thanks for watching and i will see you guys next time